That was Matt Marr with All the People Say Amen. Here on your radio station, AM 930, The Light, Edmonton's Positive Talk. Well, it's that time where we go to prayer. And there's a couple things we're going to pray today. First of all, we're going to pray for your healing. So whether your need is physical, spiritual, emotional, intellectual, financial, or family, I want you to know that according to Daniel 9.23 and Daniel 10.12, that the answer is already on the way. So Lord, we thank you today for your healing touch. In fact, it tells us in 1 Peter 2.24, which is a re-emphasis of Isaiah 53, verse number 5, that, Lord, you are our healer, and it's by your stripes that we're healed right now. So, Lord, whether we find ourselves at home or in hospital, today we claim that wonderful healing touch. And, Lord, not just for ourselves, but we know that there are people that are in our circle of friendship, or in our family that, Lord, need that healing as well. So we're going to stand in proxy for them today and ask that, Lord, you would meet that need. And we thank you for it in Jesus' name. Lord, today we're also going to pray for our firefighters. There's a lot of uh, fires going on throughout the province, and the hot weather hasn't helped. So, Lord, we're going to pray protection over them today. We're also going to be praying for the residents of Edson that, Lord, have been dealing with some real stress right now. So, Father, we pray today for the inhabitants and the people of Edson and any other community that has been evacuated, and we continue to pray for the firefighters that, Lord, today please keep them safe. Whether they are on the ground fighting it or as well, Lord, they may find themselves flying an airplane or driving a caterpillar or other material. There are uh, things that, Lord, need to be used as to fight the fires. So, Lord, we're lifting them up to you today. Lord, protect each one. Also as well, Lord, today we are praying for our family members. There's a wonderful promise found in Acts 16.31. This is not only are we going to be saved, but our household as well. Again, we pray for divine intervention in the lives of our family and friends today. And Lord, we're going to pray today for the prodigals, those that, Lord, are away from you right now. But Lord, you're going to give an, an, and help them to have that aha moment. They're going to come to themselves and realize that, Lord, they need you today. And we're claiming that promise of Proverbs 22, 6, train a child in the way they should go, and when they're old, they will not depart from it. Lord, we're also praying today for those who are having breathing problems because of the smoke and the fire situation. Lord, please protect them today and help them to breathe. We pray for that right now. And Lord, one final thing, and that is simply this. Lord, would you order our steps today? The Bible does say that the steps of a good person are ordered by the Lord. Would you order our steps today? We ask all these things in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Well, if you have a praise report or prayer request, hey, listen, I would love to hear from you today. You can call or text me at 780-430-9300, or you can contact me by email. That's robert.dean at shinefm.com. I would love to hear from you today. Also as well, don't forget to pray for us here at AM 930 The Light and our sister station, 105.9 Shine FM. Good morning, Austin.